Hey guys, it's Kyle again, and this is the Prism Trap variant for the FTX Horus in Modern Warfare 3. So yeah, we're back on more Modern Warfare 3. Season 5 is finally here. The WWE themed stuff, we got the new DLC maps, new store bundles, no one cares. No new events yet, but I think there'll be one starting next week. We've got the aftermarket part for the Moors, and obviously all of the Battle Pass variants. This is a very good season. We have some very good looking variants this time around. The first video this season is on this right here, the Prism Trap variant. You get it instantly when you you buy the battle pass yeah we're gonna get to some gameplay of the variant and as always guys if you enjoy the variant videos be sure to like and subscribe for more this is the class i made around the variant pretty much nothing's been changed except the muzzle thing has literally no recoil if you wanted a bit of extra damage range you could put on the high grain rounds and if you wanted extra aim walking movement speed you could take off the rear grip for a stock like this one but apart from that that's pretty much it these are the perks i was using and yeah guys enjoy the video Alright, so this is what the variant looks like. This is a pretty good looking one. Start off the season with. Must say, looking at all the Battle Pass variants this season. This is the best season by far. Every single variant looks good. I don't know if you guys remember, but in Modern Warfare 2, Season 2, they had all the red shiny tiger. Looking variant. That's my favourite season in any card for the Battle Pass. I know people don't really give a shit about Battle Passes anymore, but I do. I just love the amount of good looking variants we get. This season's no different, and I'll tell you this, we have a lot of good sniper variants. The variant for the Stalker, oh my god. Ah, no. See, with this, because it's an SMG, you could do with more aim walking movement speed. See, if I take off the rear grip and put on something like this, eh, it changes the way it looks, you know, the stock. The thing is, the stock is probably the thing you'd want to change the most because it's the back of the gun. You see how much better that feels. I even have stalker boots on. So if you wanted to change certain attachments, you could. Yeah, what do you guys think of this variant? I love the purple and white. It's kind of like sporty theme. I don't know why. You see the purple stock. It's actually pretty bright. It's pretty noticeable if you change it. I don't care too much for aesthetic, but I try to keep the variant how it's given to me. Just for the sake of it. Oh my god, this thing's going all. Oh. oh my god. Where are they? Playing on the new map, obviously. This one's called Bait. I love this map already. This map plays so well. You've got the cell shaded version of some of the other maps. They look pretty good as well. Then you obviously got that other cell shaded DLC map. That one's pretty decent. Okay guys, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Like I always say, if you are new around here, be sure to like and subscribe for more. And I will see you on the next video.